Hey everybody, it's Angie and welcome to Hot and Flashy. Hey, I've been doing a little shopping at all the uh, summer sales that are going on right now and um, I just wanted to show you what I got. I feel like it's kind of a, turning into a little bit of a haul because I keep you know going places and shopping for things and buying because I was shopping for my daughter's graduation gift she's graduating from high school or maybe by the time I get this up she will have graduated from high school and so um, you know the kids these days uh, what happened in the days when you would get your kid a practical gift for high school graduation like I think uh, back in the day you always got a watch or a set of luggage or even I remember someone got a typewriter um, or a fancy piece of jewelry that you would hand down to your kids later in your life. So with the kids being label obsessed like they are these days, what my daughter wants for graduation is a high-end purse and a high-end pair of sandals to wear to graduation to go with because they have to wear a white dress and the gown and everything. And also, you know, to have going forward. So I was at Nordstrom because they had the super high-end designer shoes and we bought her a pair of Prada shoes to wear for her graduation and I can't even believe that I bought these things but the only reason I bought them is because that their uh, the Nordstrom designer sale was starting like a week after we were in there and the saleswoman took my name and all my information and said look if these go on sale and I can get them in her size do you want them and I said oh my gosh they're so expensive but you know I'll take them if they're at least 40 percent off a week later, I get an email saying that my purchase has is confirmed and they're on their way to me. I'm like, what? Oh my God. Anyway, she went ahead and put it on my Nordstrom charge and sent them over. So I am now the proud owner of a brand new and beautiful pair of Prada shoes. Can you believe it? Um, they're in my possession now because graduation is happening in a couple days and I haven't given them to my daughter yet. But she's going to be the proud owner of them. And let me just show you. I thought I'd show you these Prada shoes. Um, they're beautiful, but they retail normally for $690. And um, I just can't believe that it would be that much for this shoe. Just because it says Prada right there. I mean, they're beautiful. My daughter's going to look great in them and everything, but 700 bucks? I don't know. But whatever, um, they were f at least 40% off. I think I paid just over 400 for them, which I still think is ridiculous. But, um, you know, what are you going to do? It's what she wants. So anyway, those are the Prada shoes that I bought for my very lucky and very spoiled daughter. Big event in our lives, very sad, very happy all at the same time, and she's going to be going off to U Miami in the fall uh, in Miami, Florida, and I'm going to miss her terribly. So anyway, what makes me happy when I'm thinking about uh, <laughs> shipping off my daughter into the wilds of the world? But shopping, and shopping I have been. So also on that trip to Nordstrom, they were having their semi-annual 40% off sale. The first thing that I bought that I am absolutely loving and so glad I got it is this ring. Isn't that pretty? This is a um, Gorgiana and it's called the Isla ring. It's like a three-layered band and then in the front the middle one crosses over. So I love it. I got it a little big so that I could wear it on my uh, middle finger or possibly my first finger. Oh, hands. Stop looking so old. Look young hands. Oh, that's it. Much lovelier. Weird position. Hmm. I am not a hand model. So I got the beautiful ring. I think it was 30% off or something like that. Okay, sorry for the sudden distance change. I decided to move back here so that I could hold up the things and we could see them, right? Um, so anyway, this is just a big oversized t-shirt. It's a navy blue and black stripes, Caslon, short sleeves, really boxy. And I thought this would look cute over white jeans um, and kind of nautical, you know, sometimes in the summer you want to do kind of a nautical thing if you're going to the beach or if someone, if you're lucky enough to be invited out on someone's boat for a day of sailing or something. So that's cute. This is a small, this thing is giant. So that is nice, but I just loved it that it was big and I could wear it over leggings or um, skinny jeans or whatever. And then I got this top. This is a hinge um, cap sleeve print top. Isn't this cute? It's got this orange front with the v-neck. Uh oh, where's my string going? It's going out the armhole. There we go. With a um, little boho kind of tie string in the front and then the back has this really groovy little pattern 
and it comes up and around to the front on the shoulders and the armholes and that is just a cute little top also that was 40 percent off and then when i was looking in the shoes i was like oh my gosh i have to get these shoes to go with that hinge top so look is that not a most perfect pumpkin-y color match so i wore these to a graduation party the other day at my friend's house with white jeans and the shoes and it made a great outfit this is the alessia wedge sandal by tsubo t-s-u-b-o Aren't they pretty? So this is like kind of a linen-y fabric and then this is gray leather and orange leather and I love these because you guys know I have oh that plantar fasciitis and I found out I have bone spurs too to go with it so my heels are generally killing me all the time um, but a shoe with a little bit of a heel and good arch support is really good for plantar fasciitis so these are perfect and I could wear these comfortably very nice little shoe and then I just got this splendid t-shirt because anytime I can get a splendid t-shirt on sale I am going to do that so I always look at Nordstrom on their sale racks for the splendid ones and you know like I need another gray t-shirt but um, I bought this gray t-shirt it's like a three-quarter sleeve um, dolman style what I really liked about it is that it has a seam in the back right here across the back and I think it just makes it hang so much nicer so that's what I picked up at the Nordstrom uh, sale the 40% off sale the other weekend and then while I was at that same mall they had a Zara there and you know I really love I really love to go into Zara and see what they have and I was not disappointed so I bought these shorts aren't these cute I talk about the nautical theme I don't know what's going on with me I'm not into navy blue and white but for some reason I'm feeling very nautical this summer so anyway aren't these the most adorable little shorts they are so cute and they look great so I have those then I saw this little skirt I don't know why it just tickled my fancy so I bought it um, and this is just uh, like a little kind of stretchy fit and flare a bandagey skirt it's got all these panels and um, you know it's brief but when I put it on my kids go oh mom you look like you're going to play tennis so I'm like all right because I generally wear it with my sneakers and a little uh, navy blue t-shirt and I'm good to go but I love the pattern I just thought it was so cute and so easy to throw on in the summer just like a little you know kicking around skirt nothing fancy and then I got a couple of tops here is the front of it I know it's hard to see black on camera but um, it is made out of kind of like a little bit of a mesh fabric and then it goes like this and the mesh kind of goes up the arm and then it's a little more solid fabric it's got like a racer back in the back and it's just a nice loose flowy uh, flowy black top that could go with either of the skirts or the shorts that I got and then I had seen this one online and I really had liked it on the model on the website so when I went to the store I got it this one was $15.90 and um, it's really cute again gray can I ever buy a color well I bought orange right um, this is really cute little gray top Oops, a little wrinkled sorry so it's um, gray like t-shirt material in the front but as you can see in the back it's got like white um, shirting material and it's just really comfy and breezy and then what I liked about the front is it has this little extra panel on the front that goes across that was the last thing that I got at Zara then I, about a week later I was in Target and I was trying to stay away from the clothes and the purses and the jewelry because I bought so much stuff there last time I really didn't want to do too much damage this time but I did see this one cute top that I did buy um, this is an exhilaration top they had this in a couple of different colors and patterns but I picked up this one isn't that just so pretty it's very boho looking and so this is like t-shirt material navy blue straps and the back is gray t-shirt material as well again long and drapey and I just love this pattern it kind of reminds me of um, you know blue delft like those dinner plates and also just kind of a boho Indian print little top so love that and that was fairly inexpensive $17.99 for that and then I wandered over into the makeup and I tried so hard to buy new things um, I did buy a couple things the first one is the Revlon color burst matte balm in color 205 and this I've been wearing in a lot of my videos lately and you guys have been loving it so a lot of people have been asking what asked me lately what my lip color has been and it has been this but this is great really like it 
And then what I'm wear I am wearing this today, and what I put over it is a lipstick that I bought there that is the NYX Butter Lipstick. And this is in Candy Buttons Bonbons. <laughs> S-B-L-S-O-9. I don't know. Candy Button Bonbons. So anyway, um, I put this on top of this, and that's what I'm wearing today. And what else did I buy there? There was something else. Oh, I love this thing. I got this Boots Number no. 7 Stay Perfect Shade and Define Eyeliner Stick in Cool Make. You can do your eyeliner and you can do your eye makeup, and this lasts and lasts and lasts, and I just love this color. It actually came in the most beautiful dark grayish purplish blue, and I think I might have to go back for that one. I, I, I swatched it on my hand, and I just was in love with it all day long, and I was like, oh, I can't really wear this, it's too colorful. And I've been obsessed in, obsessively thinking about it since then, so I think I do have to go back and get it. So, just a quick video for today. I just wanted to show you the things that I got. Um, it's not a lookbook setup or anything, but I am hoping to do a summer lookbook, hopefully within the next uh, month or so. So that's it for the video for today, everybody. Thanks for your time. I really appreciate your watching, and I will see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.